Blue Reflection Second Light's Mei Kishida. Talks fan surveys and uniforms. Blue Reflection Second Light came out yesterday in Japan and will come out in America next month. The gamer interviewed illustrator Mei Kishida about the seeing is how he supervised and designed characters for the game. He ended up talking about the meaning of school uniforms at the topic of fan service. With the first blue reflection when Ren trying to be bluntly sexy, we just wanted the girls to show a little more character that could take a second glance and your heart will flutter when you saw them, he said. He also talked about the use of high school uniforms in the game, which it feels represent nostalgia. I think anyone who has spent their school years in Japan will have memories that invoke the school uniform. You may have a, had a crush on a girl or something like that, and it brings back a memory of being back in school when everyone was wearing them. This was I'm able to bring back those memories and share common ones with a lot of people. He continued, I'm not really into school uniforms or the students wearing them. There's nothing about them I particularly find attractive. It's really just the memories that are linked to them and the feeling of relieving what it was like to be in school. That's where I finally like the attraction. It's not so much the outfit itself, but what it represents. The feels, the games that have event fan surveys as the centerpiece are changing. Not just myself, but the dev team are really feeling that. Compared to the first game, we're taking a different approach in terms of showing how abroad appealing these characters are without having a real eye on fan service. For Blue Reflection and other series and other titles I work on, I'm seeing a change in how things are being perceived and the attitude towards them. We ask me, well, you draw a lot of sexy illustrations, but we have to say that it isn't because I like or dislike them. It's that I'm creating things that fans and consumers enjoy looking at. 